Elements that make up your own game. Before starting the video, I emphasize that I am not running this channel to encourage you in the Baccarat game or give you vain hopes. I understand players who can't give up on this game because I couldn't either. I have put a lot of time and effort into developing methods and practice tools to train them effectively. And it was all based on my methodology and skills that I had discovered and made good results in actual games with much more time and effort in the remote past. As you well know, the Baccarat game starts with only two fundamental elements, player and banker. These are the first element. The big, main road visualizes the appearance history of this player and banker simply, so it could be called the second element. Players refer to this and participate in the game easily. Just take a look at each big, main road below and think in your mind about whether you want to bet on player or banker. You're most likely to think about betting on player ordinarily. If player comes out, you might take it for granted. However, what if banker comes out differently than expected? Would you think it was just bad luck? The third element that helps add probabilities and statistical conclusions to a game of simple luck is the derived roads. So then, again, take a look at each big, main road, including the derived roads below. If you look closely at these derived roads, your betting decisions may be unlike the first. As I always say, there is no correct answer. You only need to be able to derive solid conclusions based on a solid foundation. FYI, if I apply my methodology, I will pass the bets in number 1 and number 2. And I will bet on player without hesitation in number 3. It's not a wrong decision to bet on player in the case of number 4, but I'll pass this bet for a more prudent game. The fourth element that makes up your own game is tie. It doesn't mean betting on tie. It's about how to judge when tie shows up. Tie is sometimes also a piece of important information that you can gain during the game. These four elements are about your information power and analytical skills that improve your game ability. Knowing well the rules and skills of soccer or baseball and playing well are two completely different things. As in these sports, the most crucial element in determining the outcome in the Baccarat game is mental strength. And it's the last element. In particular, this mental strength is proportional to the belief in your game ability. Do you certainly trust your game ability enough to put your valuable assets on and play this game? Do not bet actual money until you can answer yes to this question. Otherwise, you can't get out of the vicious circle except for the luckiest cases. Please refer to my words and think about the elements that make up your own game. Subscription and like may be the first step you take to overcome your limitations on your own. Thank you.